In this short video, we're going to look at importing data from Microsoft Project into Project Tracker to create S curves. We can import information from Microsoft Project in two ways. One, when Microsoft Project is installed uh, on our machine, and there's a separate video showing you how to do this. Uh, and the second method is when we do not have Microsoft Project installed and somebody has sent us uh, a Microsoft Project XML file. So here we have a project uh, with baselines, uh, and there's a early dates baseline, uh, late dates baseline, and uh, we can set a weighting against activities if certain activities have priority uh, over others. So in this instance, activity six has double the impact on the project as the other activities. And the person producing this uh, project for us would have saved as uh, an XML file, not the project XML file, and would have distributed that to us. So uh, we're going to go to uh, Microsoft Project XML in this instance and find uh, the XML file that uh, was given to us and select our baselines that were in the project. We can give the baselines our own names uh, and we can choose to ignore uh, working time uh, and non-working time, ignore calendars or to, um, to, or to smooth uh, over those calendars, but in this case we're going to get the most accurate curve we can. And when we click on import, that data, the XML file is read, uh, and we have our curve. So we have our early baseline, our late baseline in blue, uh, our actual coming up to the report date, and then our target from then on. So this short video showed you how to uh, import information from Microsoft Project, which would have been given to, given to you in an XML file. So you don't need Microsoft Project installed on your machine to use this particular mode of working. Thank you for listening.